Warning! Rhythm Doctor features flashing light and colors. If you experience dizziness or altered vision while playing, stop immediately and seek medical attention if needed. Please use caution if you have experience with epilepsy or any of its symptoms. Richard Hugh Logan Samurai. Sorry, this patient just barged into the hospital without filing out any forms. He seems to be in a rush. Let's see what he needs. Uh, okay, this is where things get challenging. So we've got a senior citizen requiring care, but now apparently there's a politician in here who demands to be treated first. Hey Ian, this is like straight out of our textbooks. What framework do we use to decide who to treat first? Under fair and egalitarian? Under fair and egalitarian RHS, what do we need? And we studied this barely a year ago, a whole medical ethics course, remember? We did? Oh, yeah, yeah, that ethics course. I didn't know that applied to real life. Okay, okay, I remember now. Quality, right? Quality adjustment life years. Adjusted life years. Yep, exactly, and how does it work? It's like a formula to calculate the value of people's lives, and the one who has the higher number wins, right? So, between these two patients, uh, does quality include political power as a factor? No, Ian, it does not. Well, if we don't treat him, he'll slash our funding next year. Case closed, the politician wins. Sorry, Gramps. Yo, what's taking so long? A tutorial? No tutorial, you treat me now. Shoo, farmer boy. Well, what's wrong with you? I don't know what's wrong with you. No, Hugh, come back. You're great at tutorials. You, how dare you share my name? Oh, great job, intern. Look, he's got two X's on his ECG. Huh? Well, why is his heart skipping so much? Is he feeling overwhelmed lately? What was that? Me? Overwhelmed? How dare you! Ugh, you wasted too much of my time. I've got an important speech to give that I'm 100% not nervous about. And I need the best possible medical care. If you fancy med grads wants to... If you fancy med grads want to still have your job tomorrow, you better come treat me at my rally. Alright. No, she. He, her, son, su, u, yo, she. Chi. This guy now. Oh, I almost missed that. Oh no, I, I a little late on that. Da 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 oh da 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 Master multitasker. Why, thank you. I seem to work well enough. Good job. Oh no, he's back. Here we go. 
What is the meaning of this? I step away for one second and you think you can get away from with using some shabby long distance treatment on me? Ridiculous, disrespectful. I came here for the highest quality doctors, personalized care, whatever happened to that. You, the disheveled looking dropout behind the screen thingy. I demand to know who you are. I'm reporting you to your superiors. What's your name? Ah, this is what I'm talking about. You think you can ignore me when I'm talking to you? I'm not. No manners around here. Do you know who I am? Well, I, I guess I didn't answer him. I'm Richard Hugh. I'm the nation's bloody health secretary. Trying to pass off my delicate operation to some intern in their basement. How dare you? Just wait until I tell the cable networks. If I'm not mistaken, wasn't your party completely okay with this whole Rhythm Doctor initiative? <laughs> details, details. When I signed off on that, I didn't think that I would get stuck with one of those... One of these bargain bin interns. I can't stay here. This place is musty and smells like shellfish. I can't wait to have a phone call with your supervisor. Good day. Well, that was something. Anyway, back to your... Back to our jobs, there's an elderly gentleman who needs me, Mr. Stevenson. He keeps dozing off, so I haven't been able to, able to speak with him yet. He's experienced some heart block. I'll take care of it and get his x-rays done. There's a new patient here, too. I haven't met him. Can you handle it for me? Let's split up things. Okay, so I get the new patient. Distant duet unplayed. Elderly patient's heart rate is being detected as uneven. Treat carefully and answer any questions she may have. Dear, could you help me? I took a fall and my heart fills off. Hey, it's Mrs. Stevenson. Before we move on, there's another condition we've been noticing. I know that my elderly patient, Mr. Stevenson, has this type of rhythm, so you probably come across it. Okay, posture check. And this treatment is for patients with heart block. Their heartbeats are irregularly irregular. Because the heart signals aren't working properly, the beat comes out with this uneven feel. They won't pulse out at a regular interval like what you've been used to. Think of it at almost like swing music and hit them on the seventh beat. Yep, exactly like that. You're getting it. Simple enough. Now, let's try a case where the seventh lands on a blocked beat. Nice, just like that. You're getting it. Oh, it's a little early. How would I? Okay, now finally, let's go over a trickier type of heart block. The nurse will play some piano to help you. Did you know she used to be a musician? See, not too bad. Now for this next case, we're splitting up to deal with multiple patients. Don't worry, I'm handling my patient, Mr. Stevenson, myself. You're handling one of our new patients. If you encounter any of these swing swung rhythms, you'll be ready. Good luck. See you on the other side. Okay. Oh my god. Whoa. 
Oh my gosh! Dun, 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 dun. I think he's here too in another room. I'm worried about him. I usually call him every morning. <clears throat> um, hello? Are you able to help? Oh, it seems you're only a finger. Bum ba dum ba dum ba dum ba dum. Bum ba dum ba dum ba dum ba dum. <laughs> C plus, right? Oh my gosh, C plus. B plus. What? Take it, I guess. What the heck? Dude, I'm back. This shift is killing me. I feel like I'm running on an empty tank. I miss when we had a full staff around here. Ugh, my chest isn't feeling so hot. This is the part where Ian usually urges me to take a break. Can't afford it today. I'll drink some water and keep pushing. Hey, actually, I need a favor from you. Can you keep an eye on my heart rate? I'll be fine, I think. It's just as a backup, you know? Ian should be back soon. We just head. Need to hold out until handover. Here comes the nurse. She's holding a phone. And I've never had such shoddy treatment at any medical establishment. It was those buffoons! They used that phony high-tech stuff. The music nonsense. Someone should fire those slackers and one more thing when I tell... Just another day. We've got work to do. Ready? One shift more. Incomplete. This is a boss. Patient fell down the stairs, suspected broken femur, history of heart, block requiring swung rhythmic defibrillation. Everything's on my shoulder. Everything's on my shoulders, and now my heart feels like it's going to give out. Please help. Okay. I have two more hours of this. Boss stage. Okay, we have irregular, irregular. What? I missed that? Come on. For my doctor to come. These things <sighs> been going on for days now. And I feel it's lying down. Thank you, but it understandably so. You might be getting pressures. Has a nurse come to change? Me? No, not since. Oh dear, we'll get her here. Let's put up the, the X-ray. Come in now. And there's the good news, sir. You haven't broken your tailbone, and your hip is entirely. Oh, thank heavens! I don't know why I let myself. No. Sorry, I'll let them do it. 
Sure, then. But is there anything else, sir? Well, you know, yes. My, my, my wife hasn't called since yesterday. We, we always okay, talk once yes, a day. Okay, um, yes, of course. We'll get the nurse to call her up and see if she's... Uh... Oh, dear. Yeah, my pager goes again. I'm so sorry, my mother had another episode, the carer's running late, I couldn't just leave her there, I called up the hospital to try and let you know, but I guess they didn't. Oh, no, they... Uh, I, I'm, I'm sorry to hear That's that. Fine. Thanks for covering, Ada. I really appreciate it. Uh, I hope the patients didn't give you too much trouble. No, not at all. Hey, okay, so, um, Mrs. Stevenson had a cold, but she's doing fine, but we still don't know if it was mechanical or physical. She doesn't remember? No, actually, no. Wait, can't we get them to meet up? Their husband and wife. I can take it all from here. Thank you, both of you. You did great. Thanks, man. Phew. Ada, you look exhausted. You should clock out. I can handle everything. Yeah, yeah. I'll grab something to eat and make my way out. Intern, thank you. That was a real... Rough one. We couldn't have done it without you. Starting to feel like you're the glue holding this place together. Good luck with the next shift. When you're ready, maybe we can drop by the vending machine. I'm starving. What's going on, everyone? I know it's been a while. For the past week, I've had hardware issues that I managed to fix. Thank goodness. And if you want to hear more about it, give this video a like. If you reach 10 likes, I'll upload a video on it. Thanks for watching. And now I'm going to take a nap. Good night.